Download this code from codegive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. The numpy.fft.fchift function is a useful tool in the realm of signal processing and Fourier transforms. It is primarily used to shift the zero frequency component to the center of the spectrum. This can be particularly helpful when visualizing the results of a Fourier transform, as it allows for a more intuitive interpretation of the frequency domain representation. What is FFT? The Fast Fourier Transform, FFT, is an algorithm to compute the discrete Fourier transform, DFT, and its inverse. The DFT converts a sequence of complex numbers from the time domain into the frequency domain. Why use FFT? When you compute the Fourier transform of a signal, the resulting frequency components are ordered such that the zero frequency is at the beginning of the array. This can make it difficult to visualize the output, especially when plotting. The FFT function rearranges the output so that the zero frequency is centered. Usage of numpy.fft.fshift Input, the input can be an array of any shape. Output, it returns an array of the same shape as the input, but with the zero frequency component shifted to the center. Code example Here's a simple example that demonstrates how to use numpy.fft.fshift along with the FFT to analyze a signal. Explanation of the code one signal creation, we create a time domain signal that is a combination of two sine waves with different frequencies, 5 Hz and 50 Hz. Two FFT calculation, we compute the FFT of the signal using NP.FFT.FFT. Three frequency bins, we calculate the corresponding frequency bins using NP.FFT.FFREC. Four FFT shift, we apply NP.FFT.FFT to both the FFT result and the frequency bins to center the zero frequency. 5. Plotting, we use matplotlib to plot the time domain signal and the frequency domain representation. The frequency plot will show the two prominent peaks corresponding to the frequencies of the sine waves. Conclusion Using FFT is crucial when working with Fourier transforms, especially for visualization and interpretation of frequency components. The example above illustrates how to effectively utilize FFT in conjunction with the FFT to analyze a simple signal.